good morning and it's a very different scene from yesterday morning here at Preston New Road thank God I had no sleep with a fear and nightmares of what happened yesterday morning replicating this morning but on this scene and thankfully it hasn't there are ups and there are downs in this movement and thankfully this is an up that'll despite being tired and quite emotional this morning um, I find this so beautiful and uplifting and so reassuring that they still came. You know, people saw how bad it was yesterday morning and yet still they came, you know. And so this is the fifth women's walk. It's a call for calm. It's where we walk up the hill. It, the purpose of today is not to stop work at the site. That's not the purpose of Wednesdays. Wednesdays is a very unique event. The purpose of today is to stand as the mothers and the grandmothers, and particularly the absent mothers and grandmothers of the people who are on this street every day. The police, the protectors, the residents, of um, vehicle, you know, the road users, and to stand as in our role as mothers and grandmothers and call for calm amongst all of those people who are interacting on the road that can get so incredibly volatile. It's the one time where the space genuinely is calm and there is no lunacy or crazy going on. And it's really important, like it's almost a reset point in the week for me and I think I couldn't live without it. So we're going to set off. I'll film as we set off. Um, but then I'm going to enjoy the day and I'll start filming again once we get up the top. So who's leading? Barbara, you want to lead? And... Yeah, go on, Barbara. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, we need to try and stay as a block again. What should we do? Yeah, you don't, if you go, don't go as slow as you go until you get to the blue arrow when you go super slow. That's fine from the blue arrow for the prayers. I just drew my pace, yeah. But until we get there, we could all stay together. Yeah. yeah. So would, you could gong at the front then. That would be good and keep you in line. <laughs> this is my granddaughter. Say hello. Hi. I want to say something. Oh, no, please come. Please do. It's important to me. What time to come with us? You what, love? Yep. Uh, we've got to cross here first, so... Let me see if the PLOs are about. Happy one play, my friend. PLOs, we'd like to cross over first right. and be on the right side. So, yeah. So, we cross over. There's approximately 70 people, I think, in my calculation. 70? Counting small kids and dogs. Go Spike, you can nick their heels. Keep them moving. Spike's well dressed for the day. I like that he wears his white coat on Wednesdays. My granddaughter is not, not always sure about what her activism is these days. She's 12. No one left behind? Yes, there is. The cross is no one left behind. We don't leave ours behind. No man left behind. I got... Fabulous. She'll catch us up. She's fast. Okay. See you later, love. Have I got my granddaughter yeah, I have. I'm coming across there. I'm just going to film this, darling. And then I've got to join them. Okay, so we're going to walk up the hill now. And uh, when we do our slow walk, um, that's where um, the gong plays, and we do a each prayer, each step is a prayer for peace. Um, we'll I'll start filming uh, at that point, and then film up to the silence. Thanks for staying with us, and thanks for bearing witness. And yay! I hope you feel as relieved as I do that yay, it looks like this, eh? That we got a better start, and that this live stream we get to share an uplifting thing rather than a really sad, tragic and scary thing.